Okay, so today I'm gonna to teach you guys how to get the best absolute deal on any lease vehicle right here and right now. Don't watch all those other YouTube videos because they're all a bunch of like BS. I'm gonna show you how to do it, like I said, right here and right now. And I'm gonna save you guys time. You know, you're not gonna to have to go to the dealership and you know, you uh, talk to the salesperson, you're freaking wasting time. And how about this price? No, how about this price? And oh, they, they got to talk to their manager and come back. You know, then they want to like tell you like how great this vehicle is compared to this other vehicle and how, how you know, you're getting a great deal. I'm going to save your time. You don't need to go through all that freaking BS. Okay, now if you guys are in the market to purchase a vehicle, now watch my other video, okay? My other video. But this is about leasing a vehicle and you're going to get like you're gonna get a better deal than 90% of the people out there, okay? Now, how do you do it, okay? Well, first of all, if you guys have a friend that's a salesperson at some dealership, don't go to him, okay? Um, and let me give you an example, okay? I have a, I went to a party, like, I don't know, three weeks ago or something like that, and I was talking to somebody, and he's like, uh, my friend said that he likes the, um, the Lexus NX 200T, and he's gonna go ahead and lease the vehicle. And he's getting a great deal because one of my other friends is the salesperson. Okay, so, and I was like, well, what kind of deal are you getting? He's like, oh, $3,000 uh, down, which actually is like upfront fees, your, uh, your down payment, your upfront fees basically covers like your tax registration, uh, your first month uh, lease payment, and so on. So $3,000 out of pocket upfront, and then he's going to get 10,000 miles per year and it's gonna be a 36 month lease, and it's gonna be paying like $562 a month, which is supposedly a deal from, my, from our friend, the sales guy at the Lexus dealership, because supposedly he usually leases this vehicle, he's been leasing it like the past like several weeks for 3,000 down and like over $620 per month. He's offering my friend like $563 per month with $3,000 $3, uh, up front. Sounds like a good deal, right? I don't think so. So if you guys have a friend that's a car salesperson, don't go to him because, you know, or, or you may feel obligated to go with them because they can't match your price. Another dealership can. So don't go to a friend. Now, so I, I told my friend, I was like, I guarantee you, I was like, I bet you $100 that I will get you a better deal. And he said, okay, fine. So next day, I, I was on it. I basically, I asked him, I said, send me exactly what you want. You guys have to know exactly what you want. You know, you have the MSRP, which is with the standard vehicle. This one here, the MSRP is like $37,000. But with all the option, it comes out to like $44,100. And you know, I looked on True Value, and you know the MSRP for the standard is thirty-seven thousand. The invoice it was like thirty-two thousand dollars. But in regards to invoice, you know, a lot of times the dealers get it less than the invoice. A lot of people say, "Oh, that's the invoice is the price that the dealer pays." Well, you know, they get a lot of like rebates, discounts, holdbacks, and all that other stuff. So they actually pay less than uh, the invoice. But my friend, the salesperson, then he'll go in and say. Oh, but you know, the sales and the marketing and all that, like whatever, I, I don't even care. I just wanna know the bottom line. I wanna know how much I'm gonna be walking out this door, you know, and you know, I want like tax, tag titles. I wanna know everything up front. Anyways, so my friend basically sent me a photo of this, okay? And this is what you guys need to do. You need to get a photo of this. <clears throat> you go to any car dealership and you're testing out cars, and you find a car that you, that you like, there's a sticker price. You take a photo of this with all the options on here. Um, if you want to save your, if you know that there's that car that you want, then what you do, want to do is just write down like all the options that you want, stuff like that. Or, or if you have a photo somewhere else, um, take a picture of it. Because what you're going to do is you're going to contact other dealerships. Like in this case, I contacted two Lexus dealers and two auto brokers. Uh, in regards to auto broker, what you guys need to do is type in, go to Google and type in auto broker, and it'll list out the auto brokers in your local area. What else you can do is you can go to Yelp.com and type in uh, auto broker, you know, what your zip code, and it'll list all the, um, it'll list the other auto brokers in your area. What you want to do is simply send them a picture of this, or you can simply write it down. Uh, get the salesperson's uh, email address or um, phone or phone number, and you can text it to them. What I do, I just text all of them. I just like send them this, 
and I say, I want to put $3,000 up front. I want 10K uh, per month or 10K per year, 36 month lease, uh, you know, on this exact same vehicle, the exact same options, you know, what is the absolute best you can do because I am shopping around. This will save you time. This will save the car salesman time, you know, rather than showing the vehicle and take like three or four or five hours and then they don't even end up buying a car. It'll save them time as well. So what you do is, you know, you wait for a response, you know. So right away when I sent these out to the two Lexus dealers and the auto broker, guess what? The one that my friend was going to purchase the Lexus off, uh, they sent a quote right away, $510 per month. But my friend as a sales um, person, the Lexus dealer, offered my other friend like five sixty-two dollars per month. You know, that's like $50 more. Like, what the freaking hell? Like, though we were friends, you know? Anyways. So anyways, the auto brokers like contacted me back and it was kind of like back and forth. It was like slight negotiation, like I'm not gonna do it. They're like, well, if, you, if we do this price, can you buy it like today? It went all the way down to $420 in auto broker that offered this price. $420 per month, including tax, uh, you know, $3,000 up front, 10K per year, 36 month lease, $420. And what happened was the Lexus dealers actually like went down. They went down as low as uh, it was like four hundred and like fifty, four hundred and fifty dollars something, four hundred fifty something, and they couldn't go down below four hundred twenty dollars. So I figured I was probably getting a great deal from that auto broker. Because don't forget, you know, like you know, it, it depends on what time of the month, like you know, you know how fast they need they need to push these cars like off the lot. So there's, there's a lot of other factors that come into like when you know they have to get rid of a car and stuff like that. Anyways, no, uh, the um, the auto broker was four hundred twenty dollars, you know, including tax. The other Lexus deal, and usually the, the, the dealerships will beat the auto brokers. Uh, actually, this is my first time in this case that the auto broker actually beat them pretty big time, pretty big on their uh, on the on the, le the monthly lease payments. And it's through Lexus. It actually this is the car he pulled up with. It's through Lexus, the finance through Lexus. It's the same thing as going to the dealership, everything. So, um, yeah, so we settled on $420 per uh, month. And another thing is too, like, you know, if, if you need to go and find a vehicle that you want, you have to go into the dealer and they're kind of pushy, like trying to like throw numbers at you, you know, you should buy this car because it's the best, he's giving you a great deal. Like, just tell them, like, you know what, you can't make a commitment. You have to, like, confirm with your mother or father or your spouse or girlfriend or boyfriend or whatever. So you can't make any commitment. Just tell them, look, give me your best price and I'm going to get back to you. And then they're going to say, okay, you know, this much down, this I can give you this price. But then they're going to be like, oh, but you have to confirm with me by, like, tomorrow morning. Whatever. Get your contact information and do the same exact thing uh, as I just told you in this video. And chances are you are going to be getting a better lease payment than 90% of the people out there. Now, I don't think I forgot to mention like anything. Um, so if you guys have questions, just comment below and I hope you guys out as much as I can. So yeah, stay away from the salespeople, uh, salespeople in, in the dealerships. Like don't waste your freaking time, all that back and forth. Like let me talk to the manager. Oh, how about this price? You know, you'll, you'll start off on a price like, okay, how about like uh, like $300 per month? And they'll be like, oh, come on, can you do a little bit more? Can you do like $340? You know, then, then you go higher, you know, the, the hell with that. Do my strategy and you're gonna get the best deal. That's it, thanks.